You've been thinking that people don't like you. It's not that they don't like you. They don't like the anointing that's on you. Your, your anointing makes them uncomfortable. And the reason they can't relax when you come into the room because something in you is tormenting something in them. And you say, I don't understand how come I keep falling out with people that I'm trying to be nice to. And you need to understand it's not your actions that they hate. It's your anointing that they hate. Yo, it is Sunday, September the 3rd, 12.38 p.m. I'm in my bed. I've been in my bed since Friday. We have a long weekend this weekend, so I'm off tomorrow for Labor Day. But yeah, welcome back to another vlog. I'm currently editing last week's vlog, so when y'all see this, that vlog will have been up. But, oh, my stomach grabbing. Y'all, I woke up this morning with a little tickle in my throat. I think the seasons, they get ready to change or whatever, because it's like getting cooler at nighttime. And y'all know I like for it to be cold in my house, so my air condition be on like 68. So I woke up with a little tickle in my throat because I think my body telling me like, girl, okay, now it's starting to get cooler at night. You can't have the air on 68 at night no more. So that's that. Anyways, I door dashed me some Eggs Up Grill. I love Eggs Up Grill. They grits is so good and they raise the toast. So I'm waiting on that and I'm going to edit and chill today. I don't really have anything to do. My house is clean because I've been cleaning up behind myself. So I don't have to really reset. The little bit of stuff I do do, I might film that later. But right now I got to edit this vlog. This time last week, my vlog was up at 12. This week, I ain't edited nothing, yeah. I think I'ma eat my breakfast, edit this video, watch some Prime movies. I really like them Prime movies, y'all. They be giving me old school lifetime movie vibes. Yesterday, all I did was go to Target and go to Best Buy. I got a new phone charger because I left my charger at school. So I got the long one. I didn't even know Apple made long chargers, y'all. I also, when I went to Target, got some pimple patches because my skin has been breaking out so bad, y'all. Like, I can't remember if I said that already, but I put the pimple patches on. They're looking better. I know that I'm gonna have to work on like the hyperpigmentation or whatever, but just as long as my skin get back flat, then I'm gonna be in the money. I can work on that other stuff later. But this is better because it was like hurting and I've never had like acne like this. So this is just unfortunate and ghetto. I'm about to start editing, wait for my breakfast. And then, yeah, that's pretty much going to be my Sunday. So let me get to it so I can stay on my Zoom because I know some of y'all be waiting on videos. Yeah. Out. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. you. Yeah. Girl, y'all look at the cheerleaders. That's what you look like. <laughs> I wish I would work at McDonald's. They want my first job doing. I know there's nothing wrong with working at McDonald's because I sure work for a year and a half. I worked there yeah. when I was in college to pay my phone bill, and that's it. My mom and dad didn't want me to work. My daddy didn't want me to work. I ain't getting okay. no job after I turn 18. Yeah. Make sure y'all subscribe to Miss C YouTube channel because if y'all don't, y'all some bums. Oh. The queen said what she said. I knew I smelled sour cream. You always talking about me, baby. Look at that bun. Uh, I knew I smelled bell peppers. Hi, bad baby. You did, did awesome. Y'all did good. Buki, what you got to say? I'm tired. About your performance? I'm tired. Hey, y'all. Today is Wednesday. We're in class. Good morning. We are. We're on our Zoom. Hi, bleeps. Hi. We are about to, well, they already started. I'm about to change I my phone. Y'all want to see mine? So this is my phone case. Real cute. Slide on. Protect the lens, even though it's hard to crack. I'm going to turn it on. Mm -hmm. Here yeah. we go. Good morning, gold. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and so pretty. Yeah. Oh, and that's cool. it. I'm about to redo mine. Well, I want to redo it for fall, but I don't know. Follow oh, me on TikTok. <laughs> about to eat a oh, plum. Do you not think of me? This is a pretty wallpaper. This is on Pinterest. You gotta get your right, wallpapers so on Pinterest, y'all. But first I have to find like oh, you gonna finish teaching the what I wanna use. The girls got the good. Bad yeah, people. do y'all see that? We locked and loaded in here. Tired of the own, what should we call it? The little honey buns. This yeah, me. this is the best one right here. Almond. Oh, my, my name is Let's see, let us get, get uh, 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it, it tastes better when it's warm. Like kind of I like warm. when it kind of melted. Right. Kyle, you about to cut you off because that's fake. Right. Hey y'all, it's Mar- one time. Shh. <laughs> Not. Oh! That stink. Some of y'all arms are still wrong. How do you prepare for a um a chasse? I know the first two rows got it. It's the people behind them that I'm concerned about. How do you prepare for a chasse? The rest of y'all need to know how you prepare for a chasse. I can't teach y'all no choreography if you don't get your technique. Cause you ain't gonna be on my stage doing stuff any type of which way. That's ugly. Let me see chasse, chasse, step, step, grand jeté. Let me see. That's it. All right, for the ones I'm gonna see this afternoon, I see y'all this afternoon. Sing clap on three. One, two, three. Have a great day. Make sure y'all get in the class on time. They doing that after school detentions. Hi guys. Um, I think it's a lot of stuff that I need to be worked on, but it's like kind of little stuff for a majority of the class. Other, um, no comment. And yeah. I think some of them need to try more than they actually try. And they need to get their movements together. If you're not trying to dance class, no point in you being in here. I feel like everyone doing what they think they know they should do, but they just need to listen, okay? <laughs> they need to dance. I see why they always be telling me I need to dance because I see what I used to look like. Hey y'all, sorry about the late start. I was being rude. Try- I am I be the vlog. at school. As you can see, I got my hair done yesterday. The girls really ate no down. Free it's yeah, okay, the, it's good for you, so. The girls ate mm-hmm. down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I got home around 9.30 yesterday and I went to bed at around 11. And so y'all know I am sleepy today. So that's that. But yeah, the girls like ate down on the break. Hey, you know, I don't know if I her apple watch around. Neck candy or whatever. Yeah. They talking about my little TikTok scroller thing that my man had got me. That's between me and my That's lazy. Y'all, she fixed Girl, I know I smelled the cat this move. Y'all, she paid people to uh, fix her problems, like take out her hair. Why you got that thing on there? Y'all, they hating on my lock. Cause you saw how she was just about to bypass me to put her stuff in my refrigerator. Can you put this in there? Thank you, love you. Oh my gosh, is that me see? Oh my gosh. Hey y'all, so it's the end of the day. It is currently 1.47. Yes, I redid my phone again. Um, I need to do a what's in my iPhone. I don't know. Unfortunately, we have after school practice today, so I'm gonna be here until five o'clock. I'm gonna try to stay chill so that I can go home on a good note. Whatever. I got some nuts that I think I'm about to eat to try to hold me over till later. But yeah, about my hair, because I did not film yesterday. Um, they started my hair at about 2.40 yesterday, and they finished about 9 o'clock. I mean, it was two people on my head. But like I said earlier, they are very small, so I think I'm getting ready to edit my videos for today, because I haven't posted on TikTok in two days. And I'm get my content done. Every time I <laughs> Hey y'all, so so it's currently, it's 526, my birthday time. Y'all, I always catch my birthday time, but two young women have me still at school at 526. Yeah, so we still here and it's some severe thunderstorms. So if I have to walk in one drizzle of rain, is two little girls gonna get sued. Hey y'all, it's 527, tomorrow is Friday. Oh, my OOTD, y'all, tell me why I recorded my OOTD after I ate lunch, okay? So I had waste some of my fruit cup on my shirt. So I got this shirt. A big head. <laughs> it's giving scrubs realness. And then I got on my cargo pants. I'm gonna show y'all in the mirror. My cargo pants from Shein. They are tall girl friendly. This is my little OOTD with my little stain. Please do not judge me, I am a child. Pants when she in tall girl friendly and my shoes are from Veins as Zay says. So yeah, and I got my braids done. It's giving. I'm hoping that I can leave soon so that I can find me something to eat. Somebody got me still in here. Oh Alice, we should've did that TikTok. Ain't this a Rihanna one that go like this or something? You know what I'm talking about? 
Hey y'all, so it is 7.58 right now. I've been home for like two hours, but I got a package today. And it is the Kismet Angel. It's supposed to be a dupe of Killian's Angel Share. And I ordered this off of TikTok Shop. So this is the box like this in comparison to my hand. My hands are long, of course, because I'm tall. You open it up. It's what you got. I'm pretty sure I'm late to the party, but I'm gonna spray it on this napkin right here. The first nip is kind of alcoholy, but let me wait. I'm gonna look it up. So the notes that I have are warm, spicy, sweet vanilla cinnamon amber woody honey caramel so the perfume pyramid which is this and i usually look up my fragrance notes on fragrantica so it says the top notes are honeycomb vanilla and amber middle notes are cognac cinnamon caramel and tonka bean and base note dark chocolate so this person said a boozy honey cinnamon sweet unisex scent magical in the air perfect holiday gift last six or seven hours decent projection it's not as strong as Angel Share, but it's still impressive. Your partner will love it. Rate 9 out of 10. Someone said it smells like applesauce or cinnamon apple pie. Very delicious and great winter unisex fragrance. So I think for the winter, I'm definitely going to be into like the cinnamon and amber scents. Mmm. The turn up is in the dry down, y'all. I got the cinnamon. I got some chocolate to me. I can do honey. So I'm, I'm smelling like cinnamon, chocolate, and honey is what I'm getting. The initial spray i got a lot of cinnamon i can tell that it's going to get sweeter as it dries down it won't be so like spicy but for the winter oh yeah this gonna eat down it's giving like cold cozy day inside with your boo you know it's like a, a cold uh breezy crisp fall night okay kids and angel you did your thing you did your thing. I smell Angel Share in Sephora for the first time a couple of weeks ago. Y'all, I'm just not getting into fragrances because y'all know I got some sensory issues. So too much of anything just overwhelms your girl. But I smelled and I was like, oh, I like it. So the Killian perfumes that I have, I did not purchase them. My man got them for me. So I'm praying that he'll bless me with this Angel Share for Christmas because basically all of my fragrances with the exception of a handful, my man bought them. I did not buy them. Praying that I'ma get the dupe and he gonna get the real one. These people with these spam comments on Instagram, what is wrong with y'all? Are y'all crazy? You know them comments that be all on Facebook and stuff. I've been through hell in my marriage. I've been hurt, broken, step out on too many times. I've always prayed, recommended doctor, eat, eat. I don't even know how to say it. I ain't about to butcher your name. Y'all be blocking them every time. Stop commenting that spam. Like, who really? Somebody probably really is paying them people some attention and, and going to them people's pages, probably getting their page hacked. You ain't finna get my page. If I'm getting cheated on, I'm gonna find out eventually what's done in the dark will come to the light. Anyways, I gotta talk to y'all about something. And y'all can tell me what y'all think about this in the comments. My man was telling me about something earlier about a student that's kind of having some difficulty at... Uh, another stage in his life or whatever and so the first thing that came to my mind was everything ain't gonna be a cakewalk I think especially me being a teacher preparing students for the real world I think that when we're in school we kind of set kids up for the okie doke like you know you try to promote positivity and getting along and girl power working together but in the real world unfortunately it's just not like that so i feel like sometimes we as educators sometimes parents mentors whoever we kind of set kids up for the okie doke going into the real world everything ain't gonna be a cakewalk you're not gonna like everybody and everybody is not going to be nice to you and i feel like i learned that the hard way i think i've said this in a vlog a couple of months before about how i went to a women's college and I felt like they set me up for the okie doke thinking that it was going to be harmonious between me and other women, especially me and other black women. So I went out into the world, you know, being me, being nice, you know, and I got to the real world and learned the hard way that it ain't like that. And the ones that are stabbing you in the back the fastest sometimes be black women. In those times of adversity i think it's important to let kids know and sometimes grown people because you know sometimes you get a little older like me when you're really sheltered and you really haven't done much and you start getting out there into the real world you 
be expecting one thing and it ain't like that. I think it's important that people know that. Like sometimes I have to, I have to tell my kids like every day, you're not gonna like everybody and everybody's not gonna like you. You ain't, you can't be bothered by what somebody do to you or say to, say to you or say about you all the time because that's just how life is, you know? And I'm not gonna set you up for the okie doke and make you think that everything gonna be harmonious because that's what we try to promote in the classroom, in the school or whatever. So, like I tell my kids, people still to this day that's, that's talking about me and I don't be doing nothing but minding my business. So I think I don't have any kids. I have my godson, but you know, he's dang on their grown. I think it's important for us to let kids know that like sometimes it's going to be adversity. In life, we have to expect adversity. We get so depressed and upset about life when it's not always good. But y'all know that in life, you're going to have good and you're going to have bad. So it doesn't mean that you could dismiss how you feel about the bad stuff, but just know that you know everything ain't gonna work out everything ain't gonna be a cake wall everybody's not gonna like you yeah i think it's important that we teach them that so sorry i'm rambling but all of this stuff is just tying in and and still with me to this day I have problems with people doing whatever and i'm just minding my business on my zoom what have you so if you a young student you're watching this even if you're grown just know life ain't always gonna be scrain bean stew beef and rice Sometimes life going to be cold noodles, craft mac and cheese in a cup in a microwave. Sometimes it's going to be a dry pop tart. It ain't going to be a full course meal delicious all the time. I'm not just at the point in my life where I, mean, I feel like I could be at peace in knowing that I'm doing what I'm supposed to do, what I think I'm supposed to be doing. So, hey honey. I'm sorry I didn't mean to call you while you was filming. Hey y'all, I'm sitting here with I'm sitting here with two of my seniors. It's Friday. It's 2.56 p.m. We just been sitting here chatting and girl talking. They got a game tonight. They real tired. They want it to rain. I'm gonna ask my man to tell it to rain. He be swearing that he be controlling the weather. I need weather. him to control it real bad. <laughs> I need a good old thunderstorm. Oh shoot, my white balance got all off. I'm sorry, y'all. It be changing because I got it on auto, guys. So that's why it be getting brighter and darker, brighter and darker. I gotta show y'all my OOTD. I got on one of the old bras, as you can see. I got this lump in my doggone shirt, so. This jewelry here, I think somebody asked me where I got these from. I think this chain is Amazon. This chain is True by Ebony. It says, I am enough. And then my 1990 necklace that I always wear. Oh, I'm wearing the jeans from American Eagle that I got. My jeans from American Eagle that I tried on in the last video. So these are them. I think these are a 12 extra long. They have the cuff at the bottom. Yeah, this is my little OOTD. And I can show you all my shoes in a minute. Yeah, I changed my hair. I had it in a ponytail earlier, but it was ugly. I just put it in this like half up, half down thing. Yeah, and my glasses from Zillow, which I know I can't see. So yeah, OOTD. And yeah. So these are my Nike Dunks that I got yesterday. They just came out, I think. Yeah, and I ordered them because I saw that they had my size. They don't even have my size. I don't know if this is the cool color wear or not. My man be teaching me about that, but I thought they were a cool color, so I got them. So yeah, these are them. And that's my old TD. I be forgetting to take pictures for my thumbnail, y'all. So I'm about to try to take some before the bell rings. Because when I go home today, I'm going home. Big chill, period. So, oh, this belt is from Target. I got it some years ago. Cool little old TD, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all, the bell just rang for the end of the day. And we just looking like, what? What happened? Oh, God, and I ain't finished editing my videos, y'all. I just took some pictures for some thumbnails. So, I'm kind of sort of on my Zoom. I'm logged in. I'm logged in right now. So we gonna see. Yeah, guys, that's a wrap for this school week. What am I doing this weekend? I don't know. I feel like my man is coming and we're probably gonna do something tomorrow. So if this is the end of the vlog, I don't know. Thank y'all for watching. If it's not, then I'm gonna keep on filming and I'm gonna just record that outro now. Um, uh, Can I get a Dr. Pepper? That's all. I just came to get me something to eat for Popeyes because I'm about to go home and I'm about to have to clean up. I don't know if my man coming, so this is what we doing. Hey, boo. Hey, Z. Thank you.
Girl, I have to give me a little this snack. Hey y'all, so now I'm at home and I got some packages. Let's open the light stuff first. So since I redid my phone, it's only right to get a new phone case. I got this off Amazon, it's nothing special. We're getting into fall, y'all. It's just this. That's that. And I got some shirts from PacSun. Oh, it's only one in this. I had to have this shirt. Oh, it's little. Here's my shirt. You see, sure? I should've got a medium. Forgot my back kind of big now. And my last package. <gasps> OMG. New Balance 9060. They're green. I got them from DTLR. Ooh. I gotta show y'all in the mirror. Yeah. Get into it. Get into it. So that's my unboxing. I'm getting ready to take some pictures for thumbnails so that I can stay on my Zoom. I have to be on my Zoom. I did order another shirt, pack sun, but I guess <clears throat> it's coming on another order. I wish I would order this shirt in a medium. I'm gonna change my phone case so I can show y'all how it look with the new phone case on it. I am an accessories girl, an attention to detail girl. Uh, if it's cute, I want it girl. So this is what the new case looks like. It's that soft material like the other one was. And so my phone looks like this now. My wallpaper says, even the leaves fall for you. My phone is dying, so y'all gonna have to ignore that. But I have Butterbella up here on the top with a widget app that I use to customize my phone. And then when you open it, you will see this. This is color widgets. This app is clock phone for the clock that's in the middle. And then I use color widgets for these widgets as well. And I just got three widgets down here at the bottom. On my next screen, I just got some pictures and some more widgets that I frequently use and my Google Calendar because I need my Google Calendar. Like it helps me keep myself in line. My last screen ain't nothing but um, like my bank apps and stuff like that. This picture says, Lord, when my heart begins to grow restless, I pray that you fill it with your divine never ending peace that transcends all understanding. This one here says, honey, your soul is golden. So yeah, that's the phone. I'll screen record it and insert a clip here, but that's basically what's on my iPhone. My most used apps are like Safari, Photos, Camera, FaceTime, Messages, the phone, Waze. I use Waze every single day. If you don't have Waze app, you need to get it. It just, this is the Waze app and when you open it, it tells you where the police are and if there's traffic and it just, I use Waze for everything. Even just riding around where I live, I use my Waze app. My Shopping apps that I have on here are Amazon, Walmart, and Target. I need to put Kroger up here because I get my groceries from Kroger now. My other apps, of course, are here. My Hyatt app because I'm a Hyatt member. So like when we stay at hotels, I get to use my Hyatt app to book my stay and stuff like that. I think that that is very important if you have your Hyatt app. Of course, like CapCut, Canva. So these are my photography apps. All the apps I use to edit photos and you know how they categorize like those fo photo apps and stuff. So Facetune, Canva, I use Canva Pro to make my thumbnails. Google Photos, I don't really use that no more. I move it on my phone, but I don't use it anymore because I got CapCut. Shopping, I got a lot of stuff on here for shopping. I need to delete all of them. But this is like my shopping stuff. Um, I keep me a Afterpay and what's the other one? Klarna, cause people got me paranoid to pay, use my card to pay for stuff. So now I just use those to pay for it cause I don't want y'all stealing my information. I need my information. So yeah, they say you use those so they can't get your card. So that's what I use. I mean, sometimes I do use my card. A lot of times I do. I need to do better with that. But I only want to put everything on corner. I feel like if I could go ahead and pay for it, I'm going to just go ahead and pay for it. But some websites, I'd be like, no, I'm about to just use this on Afterpay. What other apps I got? Productivity, Gmail, Google Calendar, of course, like I said, Google Drive, DocuSign, Lumen PDF. The apps also that I have in my, like, it's on a, a separate page for, like, for my banking and stuff. Because those are apps that I use all the time, like, check my bank account, stuff like that. 
I have my bank account still, my smart rent, my Google Calendar, Sync, Move Fitness, which is my gym, and it's Fit Electric. Let me tell you about these. This app, Smart Rent, my apartment is basically a smart apartment. I can control like my front door lock, my thermostat, and I can make schedules. So like on the app, I can lock and unlock my door. I can do my thermostat from my phone and I can set schedules or it's called scenes on here. And I have my stuff set to work, bedtime, and away. And then I have like a setting for when it's cold outside and a base setting, like a neutral setting for when it's warm outside. So a scene that I have set is like my doors automatically lock at 9 o'clock or like 9.30, something like that. Like just in case I forget to lock my door, it'll automatically do it. And then on my thermostat, and I don't know why Ben didn't set this up, on my thermostat, if I forget to turn my air conditioning up when I leave the house because I turn my air conditioner up to 78 degrees when I leave the house because I'm not here. So I'm not about to have no air blowing when I'm not here. Changes the thermostat to 78 degrees at like 745 or something like that when I go to work automatically so that it'll be set. Yeah, and then I'll just change it when I get home. I'm not changing it right now because I'm not doing nothing and I'm sitting in the fan and I don't want my light bill to be high. Duh. See like right now, it tells you that my door is locked, my thermostat is set to this and then what I really like about this is that I can control it with my Alexa. I could tell her to change the temperature in the house and stuff like that and she'll change it. Yeah, I could be in the kitchen with my Echo Show and be like A-L-E-X-A. Turn up the thermostat to da 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 and she'll do it. That's basically, what, oh, my other stuff what makes my house a smart house is I have sink and I have the Fit Electric. I have a sink light bulb and my light over there and I can control the light from my phone. And it's basically the same thing with my light over my kitchen table. This is how the app looks and it says Bella's Castle because this is my house and it says family room lamp. So basically here I can control the light like it just turned on just now. And I can adjust the brightness on here and then I can change the color of the light if I want it to be like a color. So usually when I'm having like mood lights or whatever, I have my little sunset lamp and then I have that. And then I have lights up under my TV stand that make it light up too. But I can control that light and the lights above my table with the apps on my phone. So I kind of got a smart apartment. It ain't all the way smart. It's kind of smart. She made on roll. She ain't made principles on roll. That's basically it of what's on my iPhone. I want to show y'all this screen again. I found this on Pinterest. Oh, yeah, maybe I should tell y'all that. I found all my wallpapers and stuff on Pinterest. Pinterest got the best stuff. You just type in aesthetic iPhone wallpapers and then they'll pull up or whatever you're looking for. Colorful iPhone wallpapers, girly iPhone wallpapers, cute iPhone wallpapers, haunted house iPhone wallpapers. They got it on Pinterest. But I found this picture and it looks like a song is playing, like, a, like the music app. And it says autumn, the season that killed summer with the softest kiss. I thought that was so cute. And the app that I use for this clock phone app is called Clock Phone, which is this. And it's actually a setting to make it look like a transparent clock. It's really not transparent. It's just like I take a picture of the screen and then it kind of just puts the picture behind it. It's this app right here. It'll make your phone look like this if you want like that look. But I mean, you can't set this as your wallpaper. But if I guess if you, you recording a TikTok like this or a... YouTube video, you can just use this as like, you know, what's on my iPhone and then make it like aesthetic or whatever. But click on this. This is where I change and edit the stuff to make this clock work. So the app is pretty self-explanatory. It's not too hard. Um, I would suggest you just get the app and then it kind of gives you like step-by-step -step instructions because I'm a dance teacher. I'm not a this how you do this on this phone type of person. You're going to have to read it yourself because I'll be trying to. Sometimes I just click on stuff until it works. Like I said, just to run down the apps that I use are Color Widgets, the Clock Phone app. But really, Color Widgets is my girl. And I do have the pro version of that too because I want to be able to get all of the cute stuff. I don't want some of the cute stuff. But yeah, that's what's on my iPhone. My man got us some his and hers perfume and cologne. Intense duo fragrances from the East. Hmm. Mm. Ooh. 
look at the bottle. Ooh. My camera died, but Rosasi Hawass. This is for women and this is for men. I just watched reviews on both. Mm. Look at that bottle cap. I only spray one spray, but that's good. The top notes are apple, pomegranate, grapefruit. Middle notes are iris, citrus, jasmine. Base notes are praline, patchouli. Well, we in Walmart. So somebody don't know where his toiletry bag at, so you gotta get new everything. He used fancy stuff, so we gotta find all the fancy stuff today. Walla, 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 walla. They wrong for this fan. Just sitting there. How you do they make one with the wide edge now? Wide edge is crazy. Men have hair, so they need to start putting hair products on the men aisle. Come on, Walmart. <gasps> Walmart got dossier scents in here, y'all. What? Look at they got some for the men too, y'all. What in the world? The sweet tooth by Sabrina Carpenter, the caramel one, is in this cage. I've been looking for the perfume. <gasps> because it's so out, they done got it. And they got the body mist of the Sabrina Carpenter. Where my man at? He about to... They got the sweet tooth body mist caramel and the regular one. I need it. Ooh, that is so pretty. My man Kit got mouthwash, deodorant, his cap. <laughs> that lady down there stealing y'all. Huh? Wanna go back? Yeah. That lady stealing y'all. She putting that stuff, slamming that boot bag. Why are we standing on the aisle with her? That's crazy. Halloween stuff. <gasps> as much as I love summer. I love the seasons because it look different. Where all the little stuff that be? Minute Maid got a new look. That why everything empty. What kind you like? And this was our late Walmart run. Let me get my keys ready. y'all so much for watching this vlog and i will see y'all on the next one bye